All right, got all the luggage down here. Whew. Yeah. Can we all say overpacked? Ooh, I'm tired. I don't know if you can see, I'm sweating here. So it took us about 25, 30 minutes to get to the airport from Zona Romantica to around noon. Um, but there uh, is uh, traffic, you know, once we get to the airport. It's uh, pretty congested up here. Looks like there's uh, only two lanes. Okay, there's the infamous bridge that uh, you walk across when you uh, when you land. And they say you have to go over there to get an Uber. We didn't do that. Uh, we just took a taxi because of all of our luggage. And it was raining too, so. You know, we didn't want to have to go over that big hump. Yeah, and if you got too much luggage like us, just call somebody when you land and uh, that way they can come get it. Okay. Unload it. Yes, yeah, so I don't know if this is crowded for this airport, but it does look like uh you know you know pretty busy but uh we were able to come right uh to the you know front of the line here well there is no line that's why so went through security uh really easy um didn't have to take laptops off so so it was pretty pretty easy so now we're gonna find our gate and then look for something to eat, so. Here at the VIP lounge in Puerto Vallarta. Nice lounge, friendly people, and good food. Plane is delayed, but who cares? Everything's free here. <laughs> and we have Wi-Fi. Thank you, VIP lounge. So they have a priority lounge here. So I went ahead and uh, jumped in here. It's a little small, but uh, but it works. Hey, Colton, I got you a quesadilla. Here. Also got a little pork burritos. And we got Colton quesadilla. But I'm gonna eat this quesadilla. So they have some delicious uh, looking cookies. Um, I wonder if they got some milk. Let me go see if they got some milk. So it's pretty crowded out here. You know, there's really no room to sit. So I'm glad that we were in the lounge. So we're just waiting for uh, our gate to board. So it is uh, jam packed out here. And it's funny, the lounge is all cold and I actually put on my sweater and it's kind of hot out here. I think the temperature in Dallas is gonna be 30 when we get there. So we don't go to, need, we didn't need to go to the uh, INM office here. What they did was they just uh, put on our tickets, uh, temporary residence. So we don't have to do the INM, INM office here. So that's good. I think uh, each airport is different. And uh, they said it uh, changes uh, quite frequently. So, so he said the process today is this. So we're following the process.